The first Christmas is coming to life in Knoxville this weekend. It's been a tradition for families for over half a century. I stopped by the Coliseum earlier today to see how the story from the Bible is taking shape on the stage in a big way. Knoxville Civic Coliseum. It looks a little different, but this is where um, we have had the nativity pageant for 54 years now. And we're going to take you through the whole story of how Christ was born from the prophecy of Isaiah in the Old Testament to Luke in the New Testament. The narrators will go through the story as the actors acted out on stage. So it just takes people through each scene and then moves around through the whole the story of Christ's birth. Oh, we try to make it as realistic as possible. Um, obviously, we have some very natural things around, the mulch, the trees. There are very elaborate costumes. We have a 100-person choir, a 20-piece orchestra that will be doing the music. It's just very, I've, I've not seen anything else like it around in Knoxville. We have a couple changes this year. We have some new music mm -hmm. that we're going to be introducing, so we're really excited about that. And we also have some activity packets for kids that they can kind of talk about what they learned at the pageant. It's a way for the parents and the children to get involved in the story and to bring it to life a little bit more for some of our younger attendees. Kind of helps you get centered before the hustle and bustle of the season and it's just a it's just a great thing to come and see those shows are tomorrow and sunday at three o'clock and there's also a show on monday at seven while tickets are free you will have to pay for parking so keep that in mind doors open an hour before showtime and you're asked to arrive about 30 minutes before that performance to make sure you're in your seat before the lights go down